Eric Mwade with Mwade.com. Let's take a look at the chart for Ripple versus the dollar. And we are using Bitfinex as the exchange. We can see, of course, towards late 2017 in December and early January 2018, we had this explosive run going from under 25 cents to the highs currently of about 3.30. A huge run up. Now, if we take a look at where we get this peak, in other words, to understand where we peak out here in terms of price, we have to go take a look at the daily. And if you take a look at the daily, we can see that there's a close here, right there. And we can see a failed breakout attempt, which was a warning sign. And that was at a price here. The failed breakout was at about 2.75. So that was the first warning. But let's say you really wanted to narrow down this high here on an intraday basis. Then you'd have to go take a look at the hourly chart. And on the hourly chart with RSI set at 26, we can see that we can use this time frame to get this close here. Why? Because this high did come with the stock being rejected when it tried to move above 69.1. That, that was a huge deal and a red flag. Now, there's also another reason, of course, and the other reason is negative divergence, where we see the stock make an improvement on an hour-to-hour -hour closing basis, and then we see that the RSI makes a lower high, and that negative divergence was also another red flag. And you can see that this is around the intraday highs of about 3.30. So if we take a look, we can see that Next time we see a stock in an explosive run, we can always look for this visual cues of negative divergence, rejection at 69.1. And sometimes we can also see like we, we can show here that there's a line here. This was the previous support line. If we extend it out, we can see it also gives us a backtest failure right here. So there was another sign that the highs came with a lot of technical red flags. And of course, since then, we've seen the stock really come off the highs because of all those warning signs on the hourly chart. So let's take a look at the current daily chart. Anybody who's looking for a re-entry back in the name can use the daily. Take a look at this breakout on the daily RSI, which corresponds nicely with this price entry before we get this explosive run. So what we can do is take that information and draw our uniformity support line. I'll have the links to all this we are discussing in the description of the video. So we can see right now stock is coming back to test that level. If that level can hold, if the RSI can hold, then that suggests that the next potential swing trade is to the upside. At the same time, if the uniformity line breaks, then we know that there is going to be more downside because of the failed RSI support. So either we get support for a bounce or failure to hold support and that failure would suggest lower prices. So anybody looking for a rebound in the current market environment would have to wait to see whether they find support or rejection on this uniformity line. And again, all the relevant links are going to be in the description of the video. Eric Moad with Mother.com. As always, good luck. Peace and blessings. E-A-C-S.